K14 Universe Mode Episode 4. Again, we are going to be doing this. We're going to be doing this right. Alright. So, last time we left off on SmackDown. Um, no, actually, we left off on Raw. I tried to do SmackDown for you guys, but it messed up. So, we can't view SmackDown right now. I can tell you who won. My character made his debut, won that match. I simulated the rest of the match. PTP won. Primetime players beat. Uh, let's see. Nah, I can't tell you all the matches. Never mind. I can't tell you all the matches. Very, very sorry about that. But I'll make it up to you by playing two matches in this video. Alright, so, anyways. Uh, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna interfere. Interfere in this match. No, 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 we're not. Right. We're not going to interfere. We're just going to play the match as it is. Make this match quick, and we're going to turn it. Entrance is off. Now, here we go. Who am I going to play as? Who am I going to play as? Who am I going to play as? John Cena or K Flow? I'm K Flow for this match. Finally, like every time I play my Universe mode, even if I like, even when I wasn't recording, I always play as freaking John Cena. For some reason, the game always pairs me up with John Cena. I don't like that. Sorry, John, but you know, I kind of want to play somebody else some of the times. I can't just keep playing as you, John. There goes K Flow taking it to John Cena right now. Look at this. K Flow off the ropes, knocks down John, going back on the attack on John Cena. John Cena reversal. John Cena going with some attacks on his own. No, look at John. And there goes K Flow. Here goes John. It's like a reversal fest in this matchup. Look at this. Oh my gosh, there goes K Flow. Takes out John. And there goes K Flow. Celebrating, but this may not be the time to do it. Oh my gosh. That might not be the time to do it. Now here goes K Flow. Trying to celebrate again. This time does a quick one. It was a quick taunt right there. He goes punching. It was K Flow setting John up for. What's Kayflo setting John up for? Here we go. Oh my gosh. That could be it for John Cena. One, two, no, kick out by John. But Kayflo had a trick up his sleeves. Here we go. Oh my gosh, what a move. He goes after 377. One, two, three, takes out John Cena. That was a fast match, ladies and gentlemen. The quickest match ever. Quickest match ever in my universe mode. Look at this. As K Flow had a oh had a signature stored up for John Cena. And then once John Cena was down, went for the pin. John Cena kicked out the count of two. K Flow got him back up. Hit him with the 377. Oh right there. Got the pin off of John Cena. One, two, three. Ladies and gentlemen, and won the match right there. That was the most Awesome match ever. Let's go on to the next matchup. Let's go on to the next show, actually. That was a quick match right there. Alright, here we go. We're going to go. We're going to skip superstars, but first we're going to look at it. Dun 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 dun. Alright, we did all that. Oh, that's good and gold, good and dandy. Okay, now we got we're at SmackDown. We got Damian Sandow going up against Sin Cara. Sin Cara's your winner. AJ Lee going up against Ashley. AJ Lee's your winner. And Brotsu the Rio versus Justin Gabriel in the False Cat Anywhere. Oh, Brotsu the Rio is your winner. Wait Barrett going up against Drew Mack and blah blah. And Drew McIntyre wins it. Now we got Randy Orton going up against Antonio Cesaro. Alright, let's play this matchup. Let's get this match going. It just is off, and let's go. Falls count anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. That means anything goes. You can pin your opponent anywhere. By the, you can pin your opponent anywhere. Outside of the ring, inside of the ring, out of the arena, inside of the arena. Anywhere you want. Backstage, even if you want to. At your house, even if you want to. 
as long as the referee's there to count it. Now here we go. Randy Orton making his way down the ring, but no, Antonio Cesaro. Antonio Cesaro with that, oh my gosh. Attacking Randy Orton before the match. Now here he goes. Who am I going to play as here? He's playing as Randy Orton as Antonio Cesaro steps on Randy Orton's stomach there. But Randy Orton bounced back from this attack. These two competitors have been on a roll. These two competitors have been on a high rivalry, as you guys know. Now look at this. Hopefully my recording doesn't get messed up next SmackDown. That way I can actually record these for you guys. Oh, and I got... Oh, there goes Randy. Takes out Antonio. Randy gets into the ring. Antonio's dizzy. Randy Orton. Oh, that neck breaker there. Randy Orton's hearing voices in his head. Randy Orton's going to that... Randy Orton's going to that statistic place. And where he goes to... Oh, my gosh. There he goes. Going, going to that place in his head where... Oh my gosh, going to that place in his head where he can't hear anybody, he's just... Oh my gosh, he's just vintage Orton. Ladies and gentlemen, here he goes. Count with Randy Orton, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. No, not even a one count. Not even a, not even one punch, ladies and gentlemen, to Antonio Cesaro. Antonio Cesaro's not letting it happen. Randy Orton's not letting it happen. Antonio Cesaro's not letting it happen. It's going, oh my gosh, doing the same thing, look at that. Oh my gosh, Randy Orton tried to go for a clothesline, but Antonio Cesaro with a reversal. Randy Orton, Orton Thez Press, Orton Thez Press. Randy Orton, and that's to, in that statistic mindset of his. And there goes Randy Orton, reverses it, off the ropes, I mean off the turnbuckle. Lands Antonio Cesaro going for the cover off of that, no, not even a one count. This is a nose qualification match, ladies and gentlemen, that means anything, can, anything goes, but it looks like these competitors are gonna play this match legit. These players might play this match legit here in this notice qualification matchup. Oh look at Antonio. Look at look at Randy. Oh look at Antonio. Oh my gosh. Knocks down Randy. But Randy gets right back up. Antonio reverses it. Oh my gosh. Right into right into that Miss Noku driver. That's what that move's called. Randy Orton. Putting Antonio Cesaro right on that. Right on the apron. What's it what's he looking for? Oh my gosh, springboard suplex. Now Randy Orton going out to the outside. What's he, re look he what's he looking for here? What's Randy Orton looking for? What, what's he pulling from under the ring? He's got a table. He's got a table. He's got a table, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh, no, Antonio Cesaro has a table in hand. Both of these competitors giving it everything they have in this matchup. Oh my gosh, this match is so amazing. I cannot wait for the pay-per-view. I cannot wait for Extreme Rules, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is going to be so amazing. Up on the top rope, Randy Orton goes, and oh, Randy Orton misses it. Randy Orton misses blindly. I don't know what Randy Orton's looking for here, but Antonio Cesaro trying to put Randy Orton on that table. There he goes, Randy Orton's on the table. Randy Orton's on the table. Tony Cesaro, needs to, Tony Cesaro's looking for something here. Trying to get, trying to keep Randy Orton on the table. Randy Orton gets off. And now here goes Randy with a reversal there. Here goes Randy. He's looking for it. Randy Orton. Look at Randy Orton. Randy Orton, this is why he's called the Vintage Viper. That's why he's called the Viper, ladies and gentlemen. Now here goes Randy. What's Randy looking for now? Oh, I thought I can do it. There goes Antonio trying to slam Randy through the table. Oh my gosh. Antonio Cesaro has a baseball bat. That's a baseball bat in hand. Oh, oh my gosh, there goes Randy gets taken down by Antonio. Randy Orton has the baseball bat now. Antonio Cesaro has the baseball bat. Oh, both of these competitors trying to give it everything they have in this match. Remember, this isn't those qualification matchup. So that means anything goes. Randy Orton knocks down Antonio Cesaro. Looks at Randy Orton trying to look for something there. 
Takes the table out of the arena. Takes the table out of the match. Knocks down. Knocks down Antonio Cesar. Here goes Randy. Looking for it. Randy's looking for it. Here he goes. Randy with the RK. No. Antonio Cesaro with a move of his own. Randy Orton versus Antonio Cesaro's move. Both of these competitors are willing to give it their all. Both of these competitors are willing to throw it all on the line. Randy. TB looking for it again. Here he goes. Randy look for it again. No, Antonio. Saying no way, Randy O. And here he goes. Oh, what a move. And here goes Antonio Cesaro. Looking for the neutralizer. Will it connect? Will it connect? Antonio Cesaro has him up. Slams him down. Neutralizer. Neutralizer to Randy Orton. Sorry. Excuse me for messing up right there. One, two, kick out by Randy. Oh my gosh, Antonio Cesaro could have did the the uppercut right there. Antonio Cesaro could have did the uppercut right there if he had any brain cells left in his brain. But looks like he didn't, so he didn't go for it. Because the ref ref stopped Antonio Cesaro from ever from getting that. Oh, there's Antonio Cesaro barricading over the steps right there. Randy Orton going inside of the ring here. Antonio Cesaro. Up on the, up on the turnbuckle. Oh my gosh, no! Randy Orton gets knocked down. Tony Cesaro looking for another neutralizer. No uppercut. What an uppercut! That could be it for Randy Orton. One, two, three. And Tony Cesaro is your winner, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh. I know I'm gonna get some comments. Uh, it's gonna tell me why didn't I use the RKO, but I didn't use the RKO because I wanted to end him. I wanted to put him through a table. I wanted to do an RKO through the table. That's why I kept trying to pick up the table. I wanted to do an RKO through the table, but it did not work out the way I planned. Sorry, you guys. I'll make sure I freaking play the match accurately next time. Oh my gosh. Again, Tony Cesaro standing tall over Randy Orton. Antonio Cesaro, ladies and gentlemen, the Uber American, the Paul Heyman guy. Oh my God. Winning a match against Randy Orton. Ladies and gentlemen, oh my gosh. That is it for the WWE 2K14 Universe Mode Episode 4. If you guys like it, please hit like, subscribe below. And I will see you all later. Oh.